Hey guys, so before this video starts, I uh, I recorded it before I changed something, and before that, there was I was having this problem where the audio was out of sync, and it was playing before the uh, video, and you, you'll see that it just it's like it's only slightly off, but it's it's noticeable, and. Uh, I really wanted to fix this because that bothers me, and it even happens when I am live streaming too. And I think I fixed it, but we'll see from this point on. If not, I don't know. Maybe I'll just have to ask somebody. So yeah, I'm just letting you guys know, and uh, it should be fixed from now on. But in this video, it's still um, off, but it's fixed. I just keep repeating that now. Jeez. Anyways, I hope you enjoy and I will talk to you later. Did I just wink? What's up guys, Bearded here and welcome to another episode of Sunday Scratch. Now, there has been quite a few changes. Uh, not 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 exactly with uh, my YouTube. It's just I've settled into my dad's place now. I'm now in my room. As you can see beside me, I've set up uh, my Doctor Who poster that I bought in. Um, it was in Europe, but I, th I think it was London. Can't remember. But that's obviously Matt Smith, and I have another one. That's gonna be going on the back wall over here. Where my thumb is at. Uh, my dad's actually up at my mom's place and he's going to pick it up while he's there and uh, what else is there oh I had placed a hook in front of me on the wall and I was gonna put some sort of lamp that clipped on there that would shine on me and my face would look good kinda like right now but what ended up happening was I uh, my dad gave me the lamp he had in his bedroom and it, it sits on the table and then the arm goes up above my monitor and then it just shines on me and what I love about it is uh, as long as I don't look directly into it but it, it's a fluorescent bulb so it's not that bright and it doesn't heat up all that much and it's uh, it's nice and I really think of uh, I'm thinking of doing that uh, for my setup once I move out and I am back to using my regular keyboard, the mechanical Cherry MX keyboard that I got. Uh, it's a Corsair keyboard, but um, I stopped using it because it was loud, but I have ordered uh, silicone O-rings to put underneath the keys, and it should sound a lot quieter. Um, I am just I'm waiting for those O-rings to arrive. I'm going to use it for now because the uh, wireless keyboard that I got from Logitech, it's like it connects, it works, but it's just every so often and like you're, you're typing and it's, it's not responsive and like what the hell and you keep pressing a key and then it's not like until 15 seconds later it reconnects and then you can use it. But um, I find the plug-in keyboards, they just, they react a lot sooner and better than uh, wireless and also I put thermal paste back onto my PC but when I took it apart um, I took it to a computer shop called Tony's Computer Repair or something like that and back in Edmonston where I was saying staying and when I took it in it wouldn't start or something he said oh yeah there was just like a there was a fin or a wire or something that uh, got bent or something and that's why it wouldn't start properly and he said that's all he did but then when I took it apart there was new thermal paste on there so he must have applied it on there himself but since I already took it apart I wiped it off and then I put new stuff on it's, it came in a, sort of like a SD card case I got it from the local computer store um, in town here and it's like he gave me quite a bit, honestly. I didn't use all that much. But he said, yeah, you only need a pea size amount on the uh, CPU. I put it on, whatever. And then I realized as I was putting the fan back on for, what is it now, like two or three months, 
I've been using my computer with the CPU fan installed backwards. And I feel very stupid about that, but I put it in the other way, I think it's the way it's supposed to go, and like, right now, it is quiet as hell. And also, I still am leaving the side of the case off, because um, I found when I put it on, it was heating up just a... It was still kind of heating up, and also, it was having I was having some weird issue with my graphics card or something. Because all my monitors, they started, uh, I think it was my third monitor to my uh, farthest right. It kept going black and then coming back on and going black and then coming back on. And also, I'm still kind of having it, but I have this thing where all these glitched out lines go across all my monitors. And it's like they kind of just pop up and then disappear. And then later on, it's fine. Then it pops up and disappeared. It's only... But it's only um, when I'm on certain sites browsing the web on Google Chrome. I apologize if you cars. I live near the highway. I suppose I should close my window, but I don't feel like getting up right now. And uh, uh, the other thing is when I'm editing and uh, I think editing and if I'm rendering a video and doing something else, it does that. So I don't know if. I don't really know what it is. I'm just assuming it's my graphics card. I might look into it. It might be a driver issue. Um, but I'm going to look into it, see if there's a fix, an easy fix. If it's like, oh, you need a new graphics card, well, I don't have the money right now, so I don't think I'm going to be buying a new graphics card anytime soon, or anything for that matter. But um, so that's that. Things are going better. Uh, live streaming is doing good. And what else is there? Excuse me. Um, uploading, like because I, I'm able to live stream now, simply because my upload speed is way better than over there. But I do find that it still takes like a half hour or so to upload. There was even one time I don't know if the internet was just slow for some reason but uh, I put I installed I think it was like a I installed what am I saying I uploaded uh, I think it was like a 20 minute video and it took just over an hour to upload and I have no idea why but it seemed like everything that I was doing on the internet seemed slow that day but it seems fine now but my dad kinda mentioned that there's some days where the internet seems extremely slow for some reason but I hope that doesn't happen often. I'm sorry, there was something floating in front of me, so I waved my hand. And, uh, so yeah, besides that, that's pretty much all there is about, like, the technology stuff and the internet. But, man, why? It was so quiet, and as soon as I start recording, it, it gets crazy busy on the highway. Let me close my window. There. It's just gonna slowly close on its own now. It's like, there, there's nothing, it's just wood. It's just a wood frame in like a socket. But the funny thing is, this is the way the wood is, and I guess the paint has an effect too. But if you let it sort of sit on an angle in the, in its uh, track, it just slowly slides down. And sometimes it goes a little faster, but then it slows down. And then it just, it closes all the way on its own. It's like, I don't know. Um, I just, I found that very, using. <laughs> um, what else is there? The chair is still an issue. Dad's gonna have a look at it sometime this week. I still don't have a job uh, for the summer. Still looking, still getting some replies and stuff, but it's like I go for an interview and then I hear nothing. And also the thing is uh, my dad's trying to get me a job with the government for the summer because they have these student program things, but they seem to be really slow at what they need to do. They're like, yeah, the job starts in uh, end of May. We're in the end of May and they haven't even started interviewing yet. Some of them anyways. One guy, he interviewed me and then I just didn't hear from him. So I assume I didn't get the job. Every time I try calling to ask, he just doesn't answer. 
and uh, or he's not there. Um, I think he has uh, somebody at the front desk that answers the phone, but then she just says he's not here. Um, what else is there? But yeah, I'm, I'm, st I'm still looking for a job, and I hope I find one soon. I might end up working in a grocery store or something rather than a decent job with the government, but that's going to suck because I won't be making much money. And hours will probably be terrible. Um, I'm trying to think. There was something else I wanted to say. Oh, yeah. Uh, I finished editing all my Life is Strange videos. Those should be... Uh, release soon and then once that is done I'll have uh, room for other stuff I need to finish doing Soma I need to uh, obviously the forest is still a thing CSGO is still a thing but I just haven't really had time yet to play it um, I played it during a live stream but anyways um, what else is there there's also oh, there's Ark uh, I just wanted to say for Ark, I apologize. I'll probably say it again when I record the game, but um, the server that I'm currently on, I haven't really been releasing videos from that server, and it's mainly because I was struggling to find a base and uh, where I wasn't bothered all that much by dinos, and I finally found a spot, and things were going well, but then uh, everybody decided to do... Uh, a server reset for the new maps and whatever else the update involved and uh, then I had to restart and just last night I did a live stream of me grinding uh, in arc to get started on my base and it's going well now I think I'm able I should be able to start recording um, from that point on I also find like when you make videos it's mostly for when you're taming something and if something happens or collabs uh, on the server but like just sitting there and grinding away at getting items and uh, crafting it's like unless you make in my opinion unless you make it into a time lapse it's not really that worth it and even then it's like if you do a time lapse there's you basically have an entire video or two of a time lapse of just making your base and to me that's not really having a time lapse for your entire video is not exactly good content I mean it really depends it's a, it's a it's a touchy situation or subject but anyways that's enough of that and I think that's about it I uh, might have other stuff coming out like uh, I know me and Bobby are talking about Gmod, and uh, I need to get going on the racing games. I might start bringing out uh, episodes of Rocket League. I know uh, I'm definitely playing it on uh, when I live stream because I'm able to use this controller with with uh, when playing it now, and I really like it. Like I, I like how it feels. I like how easier it is to control on there and. Um, I actually, I need to release a video of my first game because for some reason that went really well, but then every game after that it was terrible. <laughs> Anyways, uh, that's it for this episode. Uh, I don't think there's anything else to mention. Uh, also let me know in the comments down below, um, your opinions on... Uh, adding background music to certain videos. Uh, I've been told by a couple people that uh, putting background music in ARC isn't really a good thing. They prefer it without. So right now I feel like my ARC videos are just going to be the content. No music involved unless there's a time lapse, of course. But like Minecraft, uh, uh, The Forest, Minecraft, The Forest, uh, not necessarily CSGO, Soma, definitely not, but just just let me know uh, your opinions on that. I know, uh, Seb, if you're watching this, I already know your opinion, but 
Um, I, I I don't really know if you're just talking about Ark though. Uh, yeah. So thank you guys for watching. Feel free to like, comment, and or subscribe. And as always, bye from now.